A rodent infestation forced a Duval County school cafeteria to close, and now students at Cedar Hills Elementary have to eat elsewhere until further notice. News 4 Jacks reporter Joe McLean is live at the campus tonight. Joe, how is the school handling this? Well, the principal notified uh, parents immediately about what was going on here, and uh, she said she told the parents that they're going to take a very aggressive approach to try to expel these rats from the school. Cedar Hills Elementary School families got a message from Principal Marva McKinney Wednesday, letting them know that several rodents were spotted on campus and in the building, including the cafeteria. In response, McKinney said the school is working with exterminators and district maintenance staff to permanently expel the critters from the school. The cafeteria was closed until further notice. Landscapers plan to trim back nearby trees that have branches hanging over the school's roof, and staffers are clearing storage areas of of excess clutter. The principal told parents that the plan is to trap the rodents and remove them rather than setting kill traps. In the meantime, as the cafeteria is closed, the school is preparing food off site and then bringing it to the school for the students to eat away from the cafeteria. Cedar Hills Elementary isn't the only Duval County school dealing with a rodent problem. Both Neptune Beach and Love Grove Elementary schools have seen the same issue already this school year. Parents I spoke to said they were shocked, with some saying they appreciated how the school was addressing the problem. It's not something you want to hear about where your kids are at school, but it does seem like they're taking uh, as drastic of measures as they can to take care of it. I don't even want her to come in here now. I mean, because it's... You know, you think you would send your children to a safe place. Funding for the extermination will be drawn from the operations budget, not the district's half cent sales tax revenue, as that only covers projects in the master facilities plan. So you may be wondering, what do I do if there are rodents in my house? Well, the CDC actually has uh, some advice for you. They tell people to seal up trap up and clean up. That means seal up any holes or en uh, entry points in your house that uh, the critters may be getting in uh, through. Also trap up. They say obviously set out traps, uh, live trap the, the uh, creatures and then take them uh, out away and then also clean up. They say it's uh, important to, to clear out any extra clutter in pantries or storage spaces. That's kind of exactly what they're doing here at the school. Reporting live, I'm Joe McLean, Channel 4, the local station.